What's up guys, Goro here and welcome back to another 6pm content video where today it is Thursday, it is the final day of Team 1 Ultimate Birthday. We're going to hop into a brand new Grimaldo SPC and see what else EA released for today's content. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to leave the video a like, rating, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. With that being said, let's get into today's 6pm content. <laughs> And so here we go. It is also a brand new day of uh, Division Rival rewards. Now, obviously, these are the brand new updated rewards. So it'll be interesting to see what goes on with that. I have been lucky enough to pack a few more for birthdays over the last few days as well. So we're up to about 15 of those packed. Nothing really too special, though. Um, it's just all the same. Sawloth, Lavelles. It's the typical ones. But um, in terms of objectives today... We've got football against racism, and then we've also got the Bundesliga versus racism as well to get a few kits um, for doing bits and bobs like that and a few packs. So, again, this is just sort of free content that EA will always give us, which is very nice. Um, just playing games, winning games, assisting goals, all of that, all the racism stuff back in so you can use that in your stadium themes. It is the first time that you'll be able to, compl uh, to complete the Ultimate Daily Play Completionist. Um, so you get an 85 times 5 and an 86 times 2. I'll be able to do that tonight, which is very nice. Uh, I will probably keep hold of that, though, for tomorrow. Obviously, 6 p.m. tomorrow, we're getting a brand new Ultimate Birthday Team 2, which will be very nice. Nothing leaked so far on them, which will be quite good to see. If EA, or well, if like the likes of Sheriff leak that a little bit later on, we'll see what happens. But we've also got 23 hours left on some of the Academy stuff, so that is expiring soon. Make sure to get that done if you do want to. On top of that, do we have any new Evos for today? I don't think we do, which is fine. As I say, there's a few Evos expiring soon as well, so the likes of Athena and Torres. I better start getting some rival games, What, uh, especially on Athena. I mean, Athena's not too bad. Torres, though, it is technically 21 games I'd have to win. So that'll be an interesting one to see if we can do that in 24 hours. But anyway, hey-ho, uh, moving on. On top of that, for SBCs, as I said at the top of the video, we should be seeing a Grimaldo SBC for today. Uh, we also need to make sure to get our daily login done, which would be nice. One thing I was going to say about tomorrow's content as well, I'm not here directly at 6pm, so there will be a video, it'll probably be closer towards 7pm though if you see an upload, do apologise, but at the same time, seeing the Carabao Cup in person, so can't really complain too much at that. Um, as I say, in terms of our player SBC for today, he should be right around here somewhere, I would hope, uh, because... Don't know where else he is. There he is. Grimaldo, a brand new player SBC. Can play as a left wing back and as a left mid and obviously as a left back. This card, as always, is going to look really good. Four star, five star on him, which is really nice. Another very usable left back in the game. Obviously, we've got Rolfo at 92 rated. We've had Alfonso Davies. We've had Udogi. And now we've got Grimaldo. Again, another very well-rounded player. Incisive pass. And he's also got Anticipate on him. Plus the whip pass. He's got dead ball. He's got power shot. He's got jockey, technical, rapid and relentless as normal play styles this card is fantastic and i would expect it to be expensive but it really isn't an 84 and an 85 rated team with a team of the week needed in that one i think this is really really good if you've not done any of those cards that i've just listed off there you have to do this card because this will be your top tier left back going into team of the season where you'll be able to use them for probably another month or so which i think is really good at that cheap of an spc to get a card for about a month I think it's really, really good. So, fair play to EA on doing that. Now, the other thing as well that's happened today is servers are down right now for PS. So, some people can't claim rival rewards. Some people can't do gameplay. I don't really know what's going on too much. But, there isn't really too much content. So, I wouldn't worry too much about it unless you want to get some gameplay done. Especially to, like, qualify for champs or whatever. Fair enough. But, what we are going to do is we're going to finish off on a few packs. Now, I don't know if our rival packs would show up there was 285 times twos in our rival rewards today they are both here so do you know what to finish today's video we'll end one this is our final pack going in to ultimate birthday team two so hopefully we'll get something good obviously there's been plenty of big promo packs and there'll be plenty more big promo packs coming do you know what I'm going to, I've got a few points, but I'm going to save them for tomorrow because it's probably worth doing it. I, I got, you know, baited into uh, uploading them because I think Twitch said that you couldn't and, well, I fell for it. But anyway, doesn't matter. 85 times 2 to finish things off from Division Rivals. It is going to be a foot birthday. It's a German centre mid. 
it is going to be Ilkay Gundogan as a double walkout. Now, I would love to see the likes of a Benzema, a Messi, a De Bruyne, but it's probably going to be Lebel. It's not. It's actually going to be Rod, which is just as bad. However, premium exchange fodder, which you absolutely love to see. That is what has been going on this week. Plenty of exchange fodder for cards to go into picks. Let me know down below what you thought of Team 1 and who you want to see in Team 2. For now, that's where we're going to leave it for today, guys. I'm out. Peace.